Dr. L.H. Hirnandani Hospital was founded in the honor of legend Padma Bhushan Dr. L.H. Hirnandani. It is a formidable healthcare institution located in the city of Mumbai, India. We are a multi-speciality tertiary and a quaternary care hospital and we identify ourselves as a frontline provider of comprehensive healthcare. We are a 240 bedded hospital that has been modernized and transformed in its short journey of 17 years, enough to be in the same league as the best hospitals in the world. In the year 2020, when the pandemic hit, the vast landscape of India, Maharashtra was one of the worst hit states. It became the first state to impose a total lockdown. The quickly spreading coronavirus had brought our ever bustling city of Mumbai to a standstill. What people of Mumbai needed was hope, answers and a promise of safety and health. Covid was entirely a new entity for us. Erstwhile, it wasn't even known in annals of modern medicine. And so therefore, we had to create teams. And the teams were basically of doctors, administrators, nurses, including the infection control people. Now we had to form and formulate methods of treatment. And these methods of treatment were still being experimented upon and established. There was nothing really concrete in our methodology of approach. But one thing we were very clear, that we had to protect the healthcare worker because it was through them that we would be able to save a thousand lives. And it had to be done in very quick time to save our city from an unseen enemy. At the hospital, we set up a COVID task force. This was a multidisciplinary team with senior managerial staff, medical consultants, and infection prevention and control team. The first goal was to save the healthcare personnel, the warriors who would go on to save a thousand lives. Uh, during the earlier days, our meetings used to be like twice a week. Then gradually we came down to meeting to only once a week. Those meetings that we had, it really helped us to have that perspective on how we can fight this virus. Hiranandani Hospital received its first COVID case referred from a municipal hospital in Mumbai on the 22nd of March 2020. The juggernaut of the virus had knocked on the hospital's door and the hospital was ready and equipped and the staff well prepared. A very important step was taken to establish the fever clinic. So we had a long discussion within our team and then came to a conclusion to open a fever clinic which will not only treat the COVID patients but also same time make sure any patient who is not having COVID will not have any encounter with the COVID patient anywhere in the hospital. The fever clinic has treated over 9,500 patients. The hospital quickly transformed its premises to having a holding station for patients. Lifts were earmarked and so were the floors dedicated for holding patients whose reports were awaited or the positive patients who had to be accommodated in the wards. The hospital converted itself now to a no visitor status. There were separate areas for privacy and safety for donning and toffing from their regular uniform and there were bathing areas provided to the staff at the hospital to make sure that they didn't carry the infection home. Educative videos were also created and shown to all the staff. Special attention was paid to all the staff's housing requirements, mental and physical well-being. Needless to say, there were casualties in every battle. The hospital staff too contracted the disease. They were admitted, treated and came back to rejoin the battle. And one fine morning on the 23rd of June last year, I was feeling so uncomfortable. I had a body ache, which I had never known before. The minute I walked, it was hardly three steps and my saturation dropped to 80. And then I was on oxygen. The fear I had was not of death. And I'm somebody who can deal with anything. It was more my children. My children living abroad. My son calls and starts crying. He's all of 24 and says, Mom, don't leave me. You know, others, I want to come back to Bombay. My daughter, she was living with me. She was negative. So it was very difficult. But here I am. I came back and I've operated on so far 89. Doing well.
The hospital's pillars and lessons to carry forward were prepare in advance, prioritize the safety and health of those earmarked to fight the battle, and constantly monitor, assess, and adapt. True to its commitment, the hospital had participated wholeheartedly and supported the final fight back against the virus with vaccination. Most of the personnel at Dr. L. H. Hindani Hospital have now been immunized. All for one and one for all was the clarion call and it had nothing to do with the Three Musketeers. But the call to action to save our beloved city caught in the web of an unseen enemy. I am reminded of Ernest Hemingway and for whom the bells toll. They toll not for thee, but they toll for me, as I am part of a whole, my hospital, my city, my state and country. We rose as one to fight and we won the fort.